Hello everyone and welcome back to Spin Tires Mud Runner and today's map we're checking out the map Industrial Base. Um, yeah of course the garage is locked. Wait is it not? Uh, all right. Anyway we have the beast. Well one of Banksy's beasts so things should go reasonably well. There's a river over there isn't there? The only explanation for a wide open area in this game is usually... No. Alright, there's a bridge down there. So I'll well, stick to the plan. <laughs> that river was really straight though more of a channel. Let's see, just squeeze through there. And through here. Yeah, maybe I should have brought a smaller vehicle. And then this thing wouldn't have this thing's ability to basically relentlessly go through everything. Alright, a paved road, even better. Really? What the hell? Um, ooh, maybe I forgot how twitchy this thing is at speed. You want to go... Oh, okay, yep, left here, and then left here again. This is like a motorway on-ramp. Do up this side first. I pretty much have to do the trick uh, back through the trees though because <laughs> there's a body of water in the way if I stick to the paved road. Why does this truck have a magnet for trees? At least that's what it feels like. Maybe that was unnecessary. Could have been. No, it still wasn't on this road anyway, so. Not sure why with this truck I end up smashing it so damn hard. Do I want to go that way or to come around? No, I think I'll come up to this one first. And then you go over there. And there, maybe. There. And there. Oh, yeah, and finishing up there. Yeah, that seems like a plan. Might not be a good one, but it's probably some kind of plan. Oh. Yep, everything goes to hell. <laughs> I 
would be nice to find some repair points. Um, 152 meters this way. Yeah, I'll just try this. And take ridiculous damage for just bumping a tree. way a little bit. Ah, so that's what that is. Useful. And of course it makes it an open area running across the map. So it's a useful rat race if you have a sufficiently hardcore four-wheel drive. And apart from this thing's lousy forwarding depth, this is pretty hardcore. Was that? A fuel station. And I think I want to go this way actually. Right, whoops. Another wet bog hole. here and now there's a river in the way lovely hey we could just keep going that way yeah I'm learning a bit more about this map with each twist and turn right let's head over and follow the riverside it's probably way across or a bridge more likely yeah I'm gonna need a bridge fortunately I can just jump down the side of this it's almost fordable Apparently this is a crossing. I don't really trust it. Seems to suggest that it's shallow, but... Yeah, shallow enough. Anyway, this one's nice and out in the open. Alright. No, no, I'm not bad. Isn't really a road over to that one. 
Well, I can probably sneak across here. At least that's what I can get from looking at the map. Whoop. That was a bit sudden. Alright, full speed. Just another 200 or so meters. And of course, I find another waterway. Water, water everywhere. Another bridge in sight. And yet another board. Hey, pavement! Lovely. You get up some speed. You got the garage points. Anyway, we'll just come ripping through town. Which looks like it needs its grass trimmed. Oh. That's up the top of that hill, isn't it? That was brilliant. Um, oh well, there's a 469 over here. Let's see if it actually has anything to use it, if it's actually usable. Yep, it's usable. Change that, turn that off. Yeah, you're gonna have to do this the hard way. <laughs> because that was a rather dumb maneuver on my part. Fortunately this is a rather capable little truck. It's on top of the building, isn't it? Alright, yeah, this is going to be a slow, slow way from now on. So I'm just going to go straight down here. See, I probably would have damaged that uh, F-350 if I tried that trick with that. Mind you, this is so much slower that you don't really get enough speed to do damage. So that explains some of its durability. It seems to have, it doesn't have the power really to power its way over obstacles. Like this creek. Fortunately there are trees on the other side, so...
Don't know why they've got damage when the back end got wet. This is actually a pretty neat map. Right, we're getting there slowly but steadily. And of course, this being a smaller vehicle, it's actually easier for it to work its way around stuff. It's just, you know, slower at everything. Makes its way around stuff fast enough. I want the. Yes. So much for being quicker. Alright, K700 down there and all that in the logging area. Onward to the last one. And yeah, I'm just going straight across country because I can, not because there's any compelling reason to. Anyway, let's see, just gotta come across here. I don't know what this is getting hung up on. Oh, mud and rocks, mostly. Mostly mud and rocks. Alrighty then, just gently come up here. And there's another river in the way. Rather, it is the the river. I don't think well, there might be several. I better go find a bridge. Of course the bridge is probably on the other side of the map or something, you know how it is. If I keep the river just to my left, I should find a bridge or some kind of crossing point eventually. I don't. It's a long way back. And this thing isn't very quick. Oh, okay, there's a bridge over there. Alright, we'll 
we'll just loop around here and bump over these rocks and cut onto this road I need to go up this bank right about here <laughs> it's just one handy thing about this thing is it's pretty nimble slow but since it's relatively small it can get into tight places And here's a nice bog hole to get in the way. Not that this thing particularly cares. There's a reason why they still make these trucks uh, even today. Or rather descendants of them, should I say. They're not quite the same. But, you know, engines and suspension and a few other things have been changed but the fundamentals are still pretty much what they came up with back in the 60s something doesn't stay in production for that long without being good or at least good at what it's planned to do Getting dark and I gotta pick my way through these. Yeah, that's happened again. That was brilliantly done. I'm just squeeze through here. We are done. So yeah, if you enjoyed the video, please leave me a like. And if you want to see more videos like this, please subscribe to my channel for more daily videos. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time in Spin Tires Mud Runner.